Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Olena's Bakehouse. It could be Olena. Should it? Who would knows? it be Olena? Who knows? We would probably <laughs> say Olena, but it could be Olena, like like olive. So, okay. Um, uh, they're made in Australia. Uh, this is Olena's Bakehouse Seeded Crackers. We have sour cream and chives. This one is the balsamic vinegar and caramelized onion. And chili them up. These were $4.99 each, $5 a box at Meyer. So, um, I'm just gonna go ahead and open it and hand it to you. It was in a package like this. It says, at Olena's Bakehouse, we are serious about baking. We take time to perfectly craft each recipe for the most delicious products for you to enjoy and share. Our seeded snackers are made with simple, real ingredients, then slow baked in small batches for the perfect light and crunchy texture. With the goodness of whole seeds and delicious flavor combinations, seeded crackers are the perfect snack to satisfy those savory cravings. They are gluten-free, keto-friendly, all-natural, oven-baked, light and crunchy, delicious, and gluten-free. It says, uh, keep in a cool, dry place, made in Australia. Uh, it says, six servings are in the package. Six crackers are 110 calories. Okay. Mm. It's a very strong, um, or the texture is a very strong um, um, sesame seed, sunflower seed kind of texture. I love that sunflower seed. Mm -hmm. I love, well, I call them sunflower kernels, kernels because it's yeah. not, that. well, they're saying sunflower seed, but. Yeah. You don't get the shells. No, so just that middle part, the good mm -hmm. part, is the sunflower kernel um that to me is the most prominent flavor in there but now you do get the um the onion flavor too mm -hmm. i think those are really nice i yeah. could eat a lot of those they're yeah. a, they're a nice texture um i think if you like eating sunflower kernels mm -hmm. then uh, you'll really like these because that's most of the texture is those sunflower kernels. Yes. I would suggest having a drink. They're just going to dry your mouth out. Well, way. because they're so, they're, they are so seedy. There's a lot going on. Mm -hmm. And so, this is going to sound gross, but you think you've got it all swallowed and you haven't. you mm -hmm. still got bits and bobs everywhere. Yes. So, just, you might want a drink, but I do really mm -hmm. like the, the yep. flavor of those. Now, I don't know about the sour cream part, but you definitely get the oniony chai part. Right. That's what you get. I, I agree with you. That's why I didn't say the sour cream. Okay. Look good. So these. Yeah, if you don't like a seed texture, you'll hate those. Yes. <laughs> of course, you wouldn't be buying them either, but. Right. So these um, are the balsamic vinegar and caramelized onion. Same calories. They kind of remind you of those little bird finger seeds. Seed mm -hmm. things, don't they? Yeah. 81% seeds. Yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised it's not even higher than anyone. Yeah, it has white sesame seed, linseed, sunflower seed, pumpkin seed. These are a little more like orange color, but that's it. Wow. That does not taste like what they're calling it. Mm -mm. That almost tastes like a barbecue. No, no. You're not saying what I'm waiting for. It's very specific and you love it. I do like the flavor. It's a very sharp flavor. Oh, honey mustard. Mm-hmm. I was yeah. trying to think of what that flavor is. It's yeah, honey mustard. It is 100% honey mustard. It, right when I put it in my mouth, I thought Snyder's of Hanover, mm -hmm. which is really, really well coated with honey mustard because Kevin loves those, those mm -hmm. pieces of pretzel. Um, yeah, that's dead on that flavor. That is dead on honey mustard. They should have called those uh, honey mustard. because yeah, that's they could have. They nailed the flavor. It, if you if you're eating these in Australia, I think it was Madison that told me when she saw the grocery haul. I, if it was somebody else, I'm sorry. I'm thinking it was Madison that I eat those, uh, and we get those in Australia, and I eat those. And I'm thinking, how does she get those there of all things? Well, because they're made in Australia. Right. If if you're ever if we're ever talking about honey mustard and and what it tastes like, this is what our honey mustard tastes mm -hmm. like, it, or at least Snyder's. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's that's what it tastes like. Yeah, I've got I like other that. honey mustard that tastes like the Snyder's one, which is my favorite. So, 
The Snyders are the are the best representation of Honey Mustard. Yeah. Okay. Now, those are good. I like and those. she told me which same ones, texture by the way. She told me which ones were her favorite, and I do not remember because we bought these weeks ago. Um, that's the way it usually happens. We buy things. You know, I buy things when I see them, but that doesn't mean necessarily mean we're going to be able to review them right away. So they might be up in the cabinet for um, a month or more. Uh, but now these are good until August, so it's not like we were in any rush. This is the chili and lime. Same calories. It's mainly lime. Lime. Mm hmm I wish it wasn't. I wish it was mainly chili. I don't mind it, but I would rather I would rather have less lime and more I like chili powder. So I would like um this tastes like an actual like chili. A chili pepper. A chili pepper, yeah. I wish it had been chili powder. Yeah. And then I would have been over the moon about it. It's lime. From the time you put it in your mouth to the, to the end, yes. Then you get a slight like tingle, like a little burn, a little heat from mm -hmm. the chili. Um, but mm -hmm. I never really get the taste of chili. Maybe no. a little, maybe a little well, bit. But it's mostly overridden by the lime. You do get the chili pepper flavor under. Yeah, it's it, yeah, it's, it's like the lime is so strong. The lime yeah, is up here. Now. The chili's down here. So yeah, I don't the, even taste the seeds. I mean, that's how strong the yes, lime is. Yes, yes, it yes. The lime is so strong you don't taste any mm -hmm. uh, no sunflower seeds or anything anymore. I think it's pretty good though. 100, uh, 110 calories for six crackers, I especially with the the honey mustard, the balsamic one. Mm -hmm. um, I would eat those. I, I like the first one too, but not as much as the, the balsamic one. I think out of the three, um, the honey mess, well, we're calling it that. What's it called? Balsamic. Balsamic. I think that is the strongest, mm -hmm. um, but I like the first one the best just because Kevin loves the Snyder's of Hanover honey mustard because it is so strong. I can eat a few of them, but then I don't want any more because it's, it's just too much for me. Uh, so I would rather have the onion, the first yeah. one. You get more of the seed flavor in the onion. Yes, and I Sorry love the, the, the sunflower kernel flavor. Mm -hmm. It's so delicious. Um, I wouldn't necessarily get the lime one unless you just I really wouldn't like either. Lime. You need to really want some lime. Uh, if, you, if you really like lime, you know, we've said before, we really don't want lime in our potato chips or any salt. Tortilla chips. Yeah, or, uh, we really just don't want it in there at all. Um, but if you like that, then then you'll appreciate these. I think they're all really good oh, quality. Yeah. yeah, tons of seeds. And honestly, coming from all the way from Australia, I'm surprised they didn't cost more than five dollars a box because five dollars a box for crackers these days is probably about normal. And you know, it's keto. yeah, keto yeah, normal. it's a keto and gluten free. So this is one of those snacks that are really really good if you're on keto. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Because some of the keto snacks are. Good. These are actually really good. Yeah, flavorful. yeah, they they are very very nice. Mm -hmm. um, I'm wondering though, from anybody, not just Madison, but anybody in Australia, are there other flavors? So I only saw these three at Meyer. Um, I would like to know, are there other flavors? Like, is there just like a salt and pepper, black pepper? Because I'm crazy right. about black pepper. Are you sweet ones? Oh, like yeah. Honey. Oh yeah, you, they could do a caramel or, or something, or yeah. yeah, honey, or uh, yeah, what is that that's in a um, honey honeycomb? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, they could do so many. They could they could go sweet or savory with these either way, and I think they would work because when you have think about it, when you have like flapjacks from the UK, you get all, uh, seeds in those, mm -hmm. and so. Sweet always is going to go really, really well with with um, seeds, you know. Um, it's just a nice experience, and it's very filling, too. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I think six of these would be really nice. Yes, I do, too. So, you'll just have to leave us some comments below. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.